Welcome to this tutorial of Edpuzzle. Once you've logged in with your credentials, this will be your landing page. So let's start our tour. Here on the left hand side, you will see all of your different options. You will always land on the Discover page. Here on the Discover page is where you will search for videos. You can search up in the top search bar or you can search via the community. When you're in the community, you can break it down by subject, grade level, country, and source. When you click on My Network, this will take you to your district's teachers that are using Edpuzzle and you can access their videos. From there, you can also select YouTube. And when you select YouTube, you'll notice across the top, here are some of the popular video creators for education. You can use these videos and embed your own questions. Once you've identified a video that you would like, you simply click on it and then it will open up the video editor screen. Let's continue our tour. Over here on the left, you can also toggle to my content. These are any of your own videos and folders that you've created for your resources. Then you can also click on my network here. And again, this will take you to any teachers in your district who are also using Edpuzzle. Here in the My Classes section, you can link your Google Classroom. You can also, at the end of each year, archive any of your Edpuzzle classes so that the content remains, but it goes to a view only. Now, let's go ahead and move across the top of the screen. Over here in this blue bar, you'll notice you have options for adding content. You can search the Discover video, which is our landing page. You can upload your own video that you've created and then embed with questions here in Edpuzzle. You could record a question which will prompt you to get the Edpuzzle extension, or you could create a student project. As you continue over, you have the question mark here to get any type of help. And then of course your image or logo here will showcase your login information. I hope you enjoy Edpuzzle.